one of the things I love so much about approval voting is that it, it's, uh, it allows for people to express the candidate they would approve of holding the office. Um, and by doing that, it uh, upholds one of the oldest values in the country, which is a safer majority and minority. Uh, and so instead of favoring just one of those groups, approval voting allows for those groups to find common ground, um, but also for people to not fear supporting the candidates that sound truly appealing to them. Um, and so in Utah, the terms uh, minority and majority are very different than most other places. Uh, and even knowing about our demographics, you still wouldn't know what that looked like until you came here. And I think that's why Utah is such a great place for approval voting, because we have a very strong majority and minority dynamic. And so we'll really be able to see how approval voting helps that. Um, and then another thing I wanted to mention is that um, land preservation is a big value here in Utah. So we have a lot of beautiful nature here uh, with every type of terrain. So desert, mountain, forest, marsh, you name it, just pick a direction and you'll find a different type of terrain. And so people here in Utah really care about preserving that. And that's an issue that doesn't fall along partisan lines at all here in the state, but it is a losing battle that we're, we seem to be fighting. Um, and so I really think that accurate representation would help fix the obstacles in the legislature uh, to protecting the land. So those are the two biggest things.